like them. Like I like them all, just like I like all of you. <laughs> there you go. We are full circle. <laughs> <laughs> no. Huge shout out to uh, Kitty Place. Thanks for coming out and oh, uh, being super me. entertaining. This has been so fun. Yeah. Last game of the day. Battle Bus is launched. I feel like after this, I'm just going to have to do streams of me watching other people's games just to get my fix. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta get my fix of ca uh, oh, casting. There you go. Yeah. That's what, uh, if, if I see someone send me something like that, like, hey, Zeke, she's doing it again. I'm like, all right, <laughs> I'm going to pull up the stream. Help her. Casting Anonymous. <laughs> Hi, I'm Kitty Plays. Uh, <laughs> I'm and addicted I, uh, to I, casting. I'm addicted to casting. Hi, Kitty. Hi, Kitty. Welcome back. Welcome Tenth back. week in a row. Tenth. <laughs> God. All right. Final game Lots of the day. Lots of people landing. Yeah. <laughs> approximately uh, 100. <laughs> approximately 100 people are in this lobby. Uh, yeah. Starting off things strong. Tilted Towers got three squads. Pleasant Park has looking like three. Mm -hmm. Ooh, and we're, we're spectating Lupo. All right, yeah. so these we haven't been seeing these guys uh, getting ended in early engagements, Gabba and Lupo. We've seen them a lot in the kill feed, so now that we're spectating, hopefully we'll get some chances to just really enjoy their gameplay. Oh! It's Alexia no, Ray! No, no. I love Alexia so much. Everyone go and check out Alexia. She's so beautiful, and she's so nice, and she's so good at the game, and I hate to see that happen. There you go. Dr. Lupo is probably also crying himself Oh, right and now. Lupo is the same. He's so beautiful, and he's so kind, and he's so good at the game. And go check out Dr. Lupo. There you go. Yeah. Also, Gubba. Oh, and Gubba. She's so kind. She's okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, she is, though. She's all those things. Me stopping is just stopping so I don't keep going forever, not because I don't think those things about her. There you go. Yes. Yes. <laughs> she also likes pumpkin pie. Fact of life. I do, oh, too. Oh, I do not Delicious. like pumpkin pie. Oh, uh, Strawberry rhubarb, best pie, hashtag oh. uh, false skirmish. There, there you Kitty go. Plays. All right, I'm going to have to try this pie. You've never had. Oh. Strawberry rhubarb, no. All right. Is that a Canadian thing, out of curiosity? Or is that like uh, a. I've never heard of this. It's so a life thing. Okay. All right, strawberry yeah. rhubarb. I'm in oh, there. reverse eliminated with a pistol. Pistols are very strong in this game when used properly. Especially. Oh, wow. Cloak and Tifu deciding on the same zone. You see these guys landing here a lot in their scrims, so I, I bet they're both like, oh, great place to land. Little do they know, they're besties over here. No, nah, they bailed. They're <laughs> heading out. Cloak and Crispy uh, are like, mm -mm, we're good. We will see you guys later. We'll catch up with you after the games. Uh, squad up after this? Yeah. <laughs> games after, question mark? Games after. Meet me on AOL, question mark. <laughs> <laughs> We're taking it back. All right. Yep. Some viewers may not even get that joke. That's I actually don't, but I, someone used it on me, but I've never used AOL. So. Okay. I'm yeah. disappointed. Too young. Too young. That is but vivid. And that guy, Barney. They, what a username. That guy, Barney. Scub, I mean, how can you dislike Barney? He's just a great guy. That guy, Barney. That guy, Barney. He's just the best. Just the resident, that guy, Barney. <laughs> the resident, that guy, Barney. Okay, wow. Uh, Bolt Naga Ops has three eliminations already. Right out the gate. Yeah, out of Pleasant Park. I think the way the bus, bus came from the north, so, I mean, some people are deciding to do the hot drops. That's what I would be doing, you know? Get the top elimination bonus. Especially here in the final game. Looks like game. they're trying to take it. Drugs, though. At least get that extra point. You need to. I mean, every point at this point will matter, so we'll have to see the final standings. But Strug's like, guys, I have to reposition here a little bit. <laughs> Bye, guys. Oh, man. He and opens the door and then crouch walks. Yeah, Nobody he's, heard me. He's got to be quiet, trying to be sneaky. And that's the thing is they just uh, looted that house. I mean, they've moved on. Them spending time to search him out in somewhere like Pleasant, where there's a lot of rooms, a lot of buildings. Um, oh, Maddie going down to Vivid. Um, sometimes it's not even worth it. Yeah, it's just a lot but of time. For them, for them, it is their last point, so I can see them actually going through and clearing it all, but... Hennis and Maddie not having a great game, but, I mean, Vivid, on the other hand, has been doing great. Doing well We've seen so a lot far. of amazing moments coming out of him. And don't forget that guy, Barney. That guy, Ooh. Barney. Aiden uh -oh. and a C's. Oh, okay. I Taking thought... some fire. I think that's his teammates. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I thought he might have dropped him a little uh, higher, though. So I thought but he did have his build thing. destroyed. Just dropped down. Decides uh, to take the high ground. I wonder. Jumping around. I'm curious to see. So they're up against CDN. <laughs> so is Nick also here? Is Nick building him in or taking out his build? 
looks like Let's it's try just them. Oh, uh, so no. Is Nick dead? That is a question. Or did he relieve Land himself of Tilted? Else? I wonder. I would be really sad if he did. I feel like he just really needs to show up in his area doing his best. Oh, and Cease and Tina Race, two eliminations as well. Nick Merckx is still alive. Okay, good. So he did decide to go somewhere else. Is and I think after five games, um, he, he just knows he just needs to be on that board. Uh, hopefully get some of the top elimination bonuses. I think he's he's always been really great at doing <laughs> doing that. I've seen him in Cyber Slay out a lot. Right. Um, he's known for the eliminations. So. Oh. So, uh, fun fact: Val. Nick Burks and uh, oh. Gronky are near Floating Island, okay. where Sean is currently. Okay, making their way to Tilted. Maybe they're looking for the late Tilted or something. So Valk did get a knock on Nikolai with a fall. So now Zate versus Symphony. Who's the better builder? Who's the better editor? I already know the answer to that question, but uh, Jack, you're about to find Got out it. too. Oh, it, does he have another trap? He does not. So now he needs to try and force Symphony to move. Come on. I almost feel like... Oh, Zate. Oh, Lupo got knocked by a fall. Oh, he goes overhead. Symphony with the outplay. Yep. And on top of that is going to be able to get up Nikolai. So he not only slays, but he gets a revive and denies them any potential points. Mm -hmm. Zexro is there by himself. And we've got, so just south of Aiden right now is Nick Merckx pushing through Shifty. It looks like they're going a little bit more to the west, actually. They're deciding to skip Tilted, maybe get some people who are pushing out of Greasy, pushing out of Viking. And I think that Lupo might have taken fall damage on his own by himself in Viking, as the map appears to be, so. Uh, cannot confirm or deny anything. It's because he doesn't like Strawberry River. <laughs> I need to try this. It sounds delicious. Uh, Crafty's taking out Punisher, Poach, and SVGE. Looking good. Punisher Finishing confirmed. off Punisher. And a little bit below that is Ace. Sitting cute. This is a lot of build. He might be able to turtle in here. It looks like Creo's pushing in. Sitting cute, not sitting pretty. That was clever. Oh, I, did, I didn't even do that intentionally. Uh, there you go. Don't you love the brain? There you go. Oh, Zexro getting finished by Aiden. So Aiden found two kills, um, one on Alexia and one on Zexro. And I believe they did end up finishing off Seas as well. Uh, 72 hours, getting in the limb on Ambru. Poach taking a lot of damage. He's only got that one bandage. Ooh. Someone just needs to look angrily in his direction. Yeah, so this is what I was expecting to happen. Ace is going to stay. Turtle. He's like, you guys, I'll let this other duo help me out. Meanwhile, Creo is pushing in. Creo and Clarify play incredibly aggressive lately. Oh, and King Richard getting some. Oh, Upshaw. Yeah, Ninja has just taken out Upshaw and JTT with King Richard. Not sure where they're at in the map, but if you look at this mini map, look at that little yellow marker left behind. Yep. I did it, guys. I'm alive. <laughs> Jacob is going to love this. <laughs> Let's take a look at this replay we've got coming in from Aiden. Oh. I'm very curious to see uh, what this replay will be. I wonder if it's the one on Sex Row. Oh, yes. no, it's a oh, Seize one. Seas. There you go. <laughs> Yeah, Gets I'm assuming it was finished. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And they look crispy, so that must mean the cloak is very close by as well. Yeah. There he is. Taking out a nice car. They're chilling by the edge of the zone right now. Yeah, coming up on sidearms and deluxe ninja build off with look raise fire. Raise people. fire is so low right now. Weepo trying to get up high ground to help out his teammate with ninja. Meanwhile, vape Jesus is hanging out in the bottom. It's like. I'm good, guys. All right, can I take this down? I bet that's what he's asking himself right now. What is this hell How by? many walls is this going to take? Ninja getting taken down by Guifo. Guifo made sure to help out his teammate there, but Ninja also has a teammate. So King Richard canceling the floor or any <laughs> any chance of him rezzing. Oh, oh wow. Oh, he didn't stick wow. the landing. Oh, You never see King Richard do something like that. I think it was just him expecting his walls were going to be built and he built a ramp and then not take any damage but something must have happened and uh he went down because he definitely did have the advantage there um 
So it's too bad to see that. A Drive, our Pokemon streamer. Here we go. <laughs> there we go. He's great. He's so nice. So he's trying to protect his boy Jiao. Jiao is like, please help me. I'm it's, the tallest man in the world. Yeah, it's the tallest. There you go. Not taller than Hamlet, though. But tall. No, sure. Second tallest man in the world. There you go. Chap is by himself. Oh, Crap, see, this is not where. <laughs> This is not where you want to be. Creo is very talented at getting the high ground in the situations. He's a very good builder. Clarify, I haven't watched play too much, but I mean, these guys, <laughs> it's like, maybe I can get some frags over here. But um, yeah, oh I think he's, gosh. he definitely hears these guys shooting some stuff out. He knows they probably resorted to, instead of searching through this, taking his entire build down. And we also see A drive. Uh, finished in the chat. He's got nothing left to work with. Oh, uh, 20 health. But he has a dream. There a dream go. to give his supplies to the opposite team. There you go. Loot transfer completed. Poach uh, over there didn't so even Aiden's look to join. So still alive. Uh, Destroy just got taken out. They do have five eliminations total, so that's getting them the one point range. So again, it's up to Aiden. He just took a med kit to try and get that extra elimination for uh, <laughs> the point. The point. The point. And then we also have Bolt Nog Ops <gasps> with the four. Oh, wait. Did they just? He's been doing a great job this oh, game. Oh, did they get Deluxe? No, OK. No. Um, that I was think... a risky play. What were those guys doing? I don't know. Did they use a Shockwave to get <laughs> just down? Just side and Deluxe things, I think. <laughs> wow. uh, we got KU and Flame and Fuzzy. Fighting it out. And it looks like Sofa and Squatting definitely have their eyes on these guys. Might make a play, probably hoping for a little head peek. But at this point, these guys, they know what they're doing. They're not peeking their heads. Oh! Well. Nick! Oh, Aiden just went down. I'm not sure if he was able to get another elimination before that point. But Nick's like, take please it, take go it. away. I want to uh. collect the things. <laughs> Here, meanwhile, I'm like, take it! Take the book! Go. go for more alerts! It's so much fun getting alerts. Oh, uh, Fuzzy, making the push, using his grappler. Ghost Aiden is first Getting down. high ground. Yeah, so Ghost Aiden, Ghost, uh, Aiden wasn't able to get another limb, so they're there with their one point. Um, and that's it for them for the day. That's I mean, it. just a lot of consistency out of Aiden. We didn't see him drop any of his crazy, crazy, crazy uh, games since the first one. Um, but I mean, maybe it was a little bit tilting to get 12 eliminations and then have another team get 14. I bet you'd be maybe. feeling pretty confident with 12, but yeah, let's see Gronky and Nick still alive and Aiden's not final game. Let's see what they can do with this. Lupo and Gubba posted up talking about oh, pie. Oh, they're still, yeah. <laughs> this is, uh, that'll be an interesting Whoa, fight. Oh, put us into this. We got Cease and Tina Reyes. Tifu Vivid is here. and Barney, Camille's and Demo, and Tifu and Chaotic. That is insane. That's a trap. Someone just took a giant, gotten the chunk taken out of him. Oh, Tina! Oh, there's a lot happening. Oh, going down to Exotic Chaotic. That's Tifu's teammate. That was Cease. So they finished off Cease and Tina Reyes. Uh, I don't know if they were able to get those four points before. Um, they definitely didn't have the multiplier, but I mean. Excellent performance by them overall. Symphony finishing off Janet. So this is good. This might be an opportunity for uh, Tifu to really show up uh, today, like he did last week. I mean, if he did get the eight eliminations and the victory out, there'd be six points here in the final game. That and would actually put few, him top they've 10. They've had a few four point games too. So I believe they do have some points on the board. Getting that extra six points would definitely put him into. Top 10. To oh. Liquid, Taking Vivid, and that guy, Barney. Just a fantastic name, really. But look how many players are now like circling in, moving into the safe zone. And you still have Beautiful. some stragglers out there. I know. Being in the storm right now, in that bottom right-hand corner, the storm is moving quick. These three guys need to decide, are we going to frag each other or or can we just make a run for the zone? Let's just <laughs> truce right we now. We all know we're in a bad position right now. Not sure who that is. Uh, Potipus went down. Looks like Cloak got knocked too. So Demo and Kayun are still alive. So they were in that house the whole time during that engagement with Tifu and Cease. But Vivid getting the high ground, making sure he's safe. Barney trying to do the same. So we got this replay coming in from Tendons. 
He takes out Bolt Naga so Ops Bolt with five. So Bolt was sitting in a really good position. I think he had um, four eliminations before that. So he's got the point. Uh, and it is confirmed that Cease and Tina Reyes were not able to get those extra two points for another point. But uh, those two are still going to definitely end up in that top ten situation. Well, I mean, Nick not Merckx definitely. We'll see. Versus Dr. Lupo. Here we go. It's happening. Oh. Lupo getting the nice. high ground. Okay. No. Now, where's Gubbo? Oh. Okay. That's her, uh, look, that is his teammate. That's not the opponent. Hard to tell. <laughs> so they're both happen. green on the map, too, so. Oh, wow, they're yeah, very low. Was, so yeah, yeah, they ground just team really disengaged. Yeah. Lupo and Gubba are sitting really in a good position. They've got lots of shield. You see Nick using bandages down below. He's going to get him to 25 or 75 health. Camille's are trying to make a push on Kayun. DMO's like, no, nah, let's just <laughs> we need to rotate. We need to go. Come on, guys. Can we just build above us? We can make a nice wide apartment. Why do we have to engage like this? Are these guys still in the zone? So it did, the zone is moving towards, OK, so south center. So they're yeah, going so they to move to north move off the move. mountain. Oh, OK, so you see a lot of people, if we can go to the map at some point, we see a lot of people already taking that position on that north mountain, uh, preparing for the zone. The majority of the zone is on that north mountain. When you already have that high ground, it's a lot easier to start rotating down as opposed to up. So making that decision early is definitely going to be benefit a lot of these guys. A lot of people pushing in from that south side now, though. Still have 37 players. All together, players. making friends, talking making through the wall. Friends. What's up, guys? Having a good day? Look at that. So I believe I saw Myth's name in there as well. He's kind of currently on the center of that mountain. 37 people remaining in the lobby. So plenty of opportunities for these guys to get some eliminations. We don't see anyone really leading the pack with a lot of limbs. So my call that people should go for the <laughs> 14 Dang. limbs apparently is not something that people were interested in. Ooh, Lupo just knocked out Nick Merckx. Gubba fighting. Ooh, good there job go. those two. Getting the loot and now they gotta make the move. They don't gotta go too far, but they do gotta move. Breaking the wall. Oh, and shots already coming in. People know that this is going to be the area that people really need to push out of. Ke oh, and there oh, you go. Oh, Gubba made a big drop into that position. Didn't build and was getting picked off by Kayun. And that burst. Now Kayun stands between Lupo and safety. Oh, go both going for the loot simultaneously. Oh, oh, oh. Did Lupo see it though? That was Kayun's wall. I think he's definitely seen it. He's just... Just disengaging. He's like, yeah. I'm good. Take the loot. I'm out of here. And look at that. Two oh half gosh. shields. Are you serious? Oh, Lupo's trying to break in. Yeah, I mean, you can't let Kayun do he's this. Not he's not very... Uh... Oh, no resources. Okay, so anyone that's sitting on that north hill right now can be taking shots at him. And it looks like they already are. He really needs to get this elimination on Kayun, if possible. Kayun had a lot of health, a lot of shield. If I'm Kayun, I just pop the half shield. That's it. I think if he Lupo is, hasn't definitely. built, he doesn't have mass. You know, that's what, I, that's yeah. what I'm thinking if I'm Kayun. You there are you Kayun. I am Kayun. He's making his way oh, over. Oh, I love that pickaxe. It's a really good one. It looks just great in the shadows. <laughs> Lupo's like, okay, he, I need one more elimination. There you go. 45. <laughs> I'm going to do this for you, Gabba. Yeah. For apple pie. <laughs> Nikolai down below gets knocked. And look, 70 targets of Spice still up. Face Temple, Crispy is up top. Lenane on the right. Nikolai going down to Vivid. We're going to start to see the resolution of this game. I know. Still 29 remaining, though. That's, That's a, a lot. lot of people in this lobby. And look how small this circle is. Lipo still alive. How He's in the zone. So if he can somehow find a position not make too much noise looks like he's going for the edit play kayun was a little i think he needs to oh no kayun's oh. gonna be able to come back and find him unless he's assuming that he's dropped down already but i mean never never assume in this game yeah i i think kayun is probably listening in for those sounds Ooh. oh and post kayun finds next him. to each other oh so Doctor he does get shot down yeah and once he has the those uh floors above him, he's able to edit and just peek 
Anytime he wants. Yeah. Vivid pushing up, trying to get that high ground really near to Poach, actually. This build that's coming up next to him is Poach's. Kane's below him, and Symphony's on that high ground. Seeing Diggy going down to Animal. Oh, wait. Aspect? <laughs> like, Animal's a teammate. Chaotic going down to Tempo, and Tifu going down. So, unfortunately, Tifu uh, not having the best Tifu games. I mean, he's still having great yeah. games, but they're not. I mean, we. You just, there's such an expectation for him now, which which can be difficult, definitely. But Aspect sitting on top with four, Creo and Claire five with four, Vivid and Party with four. Aspect and, uh, has got another one, so it's five now. Nice. Yeah, one more puts him at two points. Vivid still alive. Was Aspect alive. the one that were they in the, big, the top spot right now? Aspect and Lenine on the leaderboard. Oh, you mean as far as like the uh, standing? Well, this is the this is oh. the replay. Oh. Yeah, he just very quickly makes the. It's like the I know you're there. in here. Yeah. Yeah. It's a tough spot to be in. If you slide down it's the mountain, you take all damage. It's a terrible spot to be in. No mats, rough time. He did have the grappler. And no shield either. Vivid going down. Demo going down. Camille's going down. Barney going down. Kayun was able to pick up another elimination. Ooh, shockwave up to try and get high ground by aspect. They're on five eliminations. So these guys are the ones in your top spot. Looking to just hold that lead. They want to deny everyone all possible <laughs> eliminations. Hopefully deny the victory royale. But look at that quick build. Aspect is already into that high ground place, utilizing the mountain in the best way possible. That is how you climb mountain. I think he just <laughs> showed it to us with a shockwave exactly. and a dream a and a lot of mats. And don't forget, Aspect and uh, Lenane are currently tied for first with Salmon Ghost Bizzle, so. Eight people left. Yeah, and they've got what the... Ghost Bizzle, they're out. So yep. these guys getting that extra point is going to take the lead from them. I, uh, I don't, unless someone's able to get eight limbs and the victory royale, I think we're spectating our potential winners. Potentially, potentially. And now if Aspic can get another elimination, that is going to give him two points. And then him and Lenane could very oh. well be OK. <laughs> OK, look. Not right. a good feeling. <laughs> I thought, I literally in that moment thought, why did I just cast a curse? Why? Yeah. Not like this. Well, yeah. Oh. Caster cursing King Richard. Yeah. Oh, man. He's got to disengage. See, that, that, what he just did there was definitely what King Richard was trying to do, I think, and then ended up taking that fall damage oh, earlier. Man. Ooh, Saf and Nico. All right, so these are two players that are doing very well on the leaderboards. So if these guys are able to pull off maybe five more eliminations, which is most of the lobby. And, <laughs> <laughs> and Just, a victory uh, royale. Just take down everyone in the That's lobby. That's going to definitely put them in a great spot. Yep, they're currently Nico's six. getting currently. carried again. I could only say that because he's my friend. It's yeah, there you go. Oh. oh, wow. Yes. Okay. So I don't think, Tempo. is he actually in a bush or is he just in a bush? I think he's just in a bush. I don't All think right. he is a bush. I think he's And he's in got a that bush. two times multiplier. So Tempo's going to be really looking for the opportunity to get that extra limb because he's not in the top 10 right now. He wants those two more limbs. And if it means crawling in a bush, it means crawling in a bush. I don't think he, also doesn't he has have any mats. shame about hiding in bushes. No mats to his name. Well, he has six wood and nine brick. Yeah. <laughs> this is, uh, it's going to be tough. It's an uphill battle right now. But same with Saf. So Saf actually doesn't, I don't think he has enough resources to do the quick build down. <laughs> um, potentially not. So he's going to hope and that he's able to he hold doesn't. high ground. Maybe Nico is able to split some with him. Oh, wait, the pass no, is just grenades. No mats, he's like, hey, chuck these names. grenades. Uh, if you can get a good bounce, oh. that first one was a dud. The second one These though. ones aren't going anywhere near anyone, but he can't see through the walls like we can. That's true. All right, you get one grenade down below, not enough. Not enough. Now that's it. He can't build anymore. All right. You have to hope that Nico has builds. I'm, well, I mean. I, I don't think so, because if he did, he probably would pass these something. These guys are to definitely set. looking for an opportunity to drop. Yeah, and there you go. So Nico has enough to get down. They're going to try and get on top of Aspect's build, uh, maybe pressure him out, get the elimination on him, and then take over his base, uh, and hopefully take his resources. 72 with just a sliver of health. All right, so they're sending Nico down. I believe that he has a chug chug up top, and that's how they're going to decide to play this. Uh, have Nico go down, be the slayer. You already see them bandaging up. He really needs to try and get in there, cancel that bandage by aspect, and he does cancel oh. the med kit just by destroying his floor, actually. Everyone's Looking for the eliminations. Down. Aspect goes down. 
Oh, to Nico. So Nico did get another elimination. And Hogman and was lost the in the victory. storm. So Sap and Nico. Good job, guys. So that's the thing is they're currently in sixth place. And they get four eliminations. One so they're point gonna have the one three. point from there. Yep, they've nice got four, four extra. points. That's gonna do huge work. These guys were definitely close to the other team, so. Wow. Just wow. Great, great day for them. That's, yeah, we might have two victory We might have just shifted.